there guys how are you um I want to do a review of the bare minerals customizable get started kit I've been wearing this for six days now it's not about a week almost yeah about a week and I thought I would go ahead and do a review for you because I've been wearing this all week and I'm absolutely loving it so far for the most part um <clears throat> so for those who don't know, if you haven't seen my earlier video, I bought this kit with the with the matte foundation in tan, which is numbered N30. I don't know if you can see that or not. Sorry, I'm trying to be quiet because it's almost midnight and I've been out all day. Um, but I also wanted to show you. I've been wearing this makeup since about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 30. So eight and a half hours. Um, I blotted I think about 9 o'clock. So I will say for my personal self, that's pretty good because normally just after the first hour, um, of wearing any kind of makeup usually I look like I've slicked myself in Vaseline because I'm just that oily in my t-zone so I have a hard time finding makeup that doesn't just cake and slick right off so um yeah S um I'm only going to review, well for the most part I'm going to review the items that were in the kit so you have the matte foundation which I um, absolutely love the oil doesn't come through nearly as quick as it does when I wear other makeup. The warmth, I'm kind of on the fence about. I'm not a big fan of it because um, even though I've worn it very sparingly and then I've put it on more, you know, put more of it on before just to see what it does. It really doesn't do a whole lot for me just because I'm so dark as it is. And then when I wear it, it looks kind of ashy on me so I'm not the biggest fan of it but it's okay mineral veil I like it um especially for being as dark as I am I thought that um you know it's it is translucent in but it looks white in the container that it would be um it would make me look a little you know, white in pictures. That hasn't happened. Usually with translucent powders, when I put them on, and they don't, it doesn't show up like when I'm putting it on and when I'm looking in the mirror, but when I take pictures, I look like I have this white film on my face and it's just not attractive. And it's probably the talc. But because this has no talc in it, it doesn't show up. And that's even after maybe two or three applications, you know, throughout the day. It doesn't show up in pictures. I'm really happy about that. It also came with the brushes, these three, the Flawless Face, Full Flawless Face, and the Concealer Brush. These two, although really soft, as most everyone else has said on YouTube and their um, reviews, they shed something fierce. So other than that, I will say they do apply the product on really well. I just wish they wouldn't shed so much, but I guess it's just, you know, I don't know. I still like them, though. But um, I also used this set with my EcoTools brushes, and I will have to say I like those much better than these. So I'm going to continue to use my EcoTools brushes with my foundation. And then it, it also came with a trial-sized... Prime Time Foundation in Original, uh, Foundation Primer, sorry, in Original. Although I do like it, I also went out and bought the Oil Control Foundation and our Primer. Can you tell it's after midnight and I'm rambling or can't talk? And I have to say, surprisingly, I like this better for oil control because it actually does work, even though it's more liquidy and not as gel-like feeling because usually the um, 
this he, it has more of a gel like feeling it's a little bit thicker so um but I will say neither of them do anything to fill in my pores I will show you if you can see I have extremely large pores and then I have all these craters in my face from cystic acne scars growing up as a you know teenager it happens so yeah but all in all if you have never tried bare minerals bare essentials um, this is the perfect kit to get started because it's for $62 you get all seven products and Individually, if you buy them, it's over $140 worth of product, so you're getting it for well over half. And it's a good deal to try the product, see if you like it. If you are more, excuse me, I'm burping. If you are more dry skinned, I would get the original foundation. And then if you're like me, who's combo, and if you're oily, get the matte. I have not tried the Ready Foundation, which is the pressed powder foundation for Bare Minerals. I have not tried that yet, so I can't say anything about it, but I heard it's pretty good. And that is more for full coverage. Um, the original loose powders in Original and Matte are, there's, I'm told, is usually um, light to medium coverage. So, But I think it does pretty well for me. I love it. So I'm very, very happy with it. I'm glad I bought it and I'm glad I got to try it out because I'm keeping it. So go to the store. You can go to Ulta, Sephora, um, any of the Bare, Bare Minerals boutiques or outlet stores. Get color matched. Have somebody color match you because it's amazing and I love it. So next I'm going to be reviewing the, the All the Faves in another video. So keep a lookout for this. Everyone have a great holiday season, and I will see you guys soon. Bye.